Really, we're just a small contribution to what is an amazing effort from the NHS. They're our heroes. Something completely unprecedented in our lifetimes came about. I think that's our job as artists. We need to keep people inspired and happy, be the light at the end of the tunnel. It's become quite emotional for a lot of staff, and I think it's really good to see, actually. I mean, you open your eyes, there's, there's, some, there's somebody there for you. Always. They're angels. They're luxury angels. You know, you have this person you just call an angel in your life. They are really lifesavers. We're going to be there because we're not going to stop until the need stops. When you see the joy that you give to another, there's no greater payment than that. I asked her if she, if she, ever, if she needed anything, I can always bring it to her. And she asked for a newspaper and a, and a pint of milk. I bought her some eggs, some bread, some fruit. Thank you so much okay. for thinking of me. It's a great feeling of accomplishment because we're helping loads of people and possibly even saving some lives. My target was my age, 104. I haven't got far to go to do 104, so I should go on and do 130. People are connecting with neighbours they didn't know existed before, people are sharing fabric, taking an interest in a collective crisis. Even at home isolated, everybody can do something to help. Vic just announced randomly, um, we're going to do this every day until the end of lockdown and it turned out really well in the end.